<laughs> Hi everyone. Oh jeez. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. As usual, please make sure you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Alright, let's go. So you guys may have noticed that I did not upload a video last week. I am sorry. Because I did film something haphazardly, but I really just did not have the time nor the energy to edit it. And so that is what happened. I could give you many more excuses, but it really was just a me poorly managing my own time. Also, I tried to do another dog co-host video, which once again worked out poorly. <laughs> he can't handle the treats. He can't handle the treats. Look at the camera. Come back here. Neither of them can seem to figure out that the camera is there and they should sit nicely for me while I talk to it. This week I want to talk about how going back to work full time is no joke. I'm so tired. I have been learning a new job, so that's one thing. Plus pumping every single day for the baby. And not to mention, like, feeling kind of guilty. The thing that's different about working before the baby and working now is that all of a sudden I have all this guilt that I'm not spending like every second with him and he's growing up really fast. I can't believe he's already six months old. That just flew by so quickly. And before I know it, he'll be a year old. And then where will all the time have gone? But I think that's a common thing that moms feel working or not working. Just all of a sudden, you birth this baby and it comes with this giant sack of guilt that you just pretty much carry around for the rest of your life. The thing is, I have to realize, and we should all realize, that it's totally okay. We still have lives. We're still human. We need to do things. We need to pee whenever we need to pee. We need to eat. And sometimes, we need interaction with other adults. I have to admit, it has been pretty refreshing to be in an environment that's not just tiny all the time and to be able to go to the bathroom whenever I want and to be able to go and get lunch whenever I want. But then I also feel really bad that I'm not hanging out with him, which I really want to do 24-7 because he's just that cool. I don't know if anything really gets rid of that feeling, but I think we can kind of just like forgive ourselves for also being people <laughs> that need things. and. When I bring Tiny to daycare and I see how he acts around the other babies, he just loves other babies. It kind of eases the guilt, I guess, for me as well, because it, he's having a great time. It's not like he's having a horrible time without me. He is loving it. Tomorrow, we actually have our first parent-teacher conference, Mike and I. Uh, I don't really know what they're gonna tell us, because Tiny's six months old. I'm kind of excited, because it's just like the beginning of a whole bunch of parent-teacher conferences, and I'm going to guess that this one will probably be the easiest. Let me know in the comments section below if you guys feel an enormous amount of guilt as parents about anything, and how you kind of deal with it slash, I don't know, make it not as bad. How are you working parents out there balancing mom and dad life slash executive slash working person life? Let me know if you guys have any tips or advice or anything that would be helpful because man, I will take it. Thanks for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. There's a button up there. If you want to see my last video, you can click here. If you want to see more mom stuff, you can click here. And if you're using the YouTube app on your mobile device, you can click the i button. And hopefully I put stuff there that's kind of relevant to this video. And if it's not relevant, then I mean enjoy it anyway. It's probably great. And now that we're at the end of this video, it's time for This is a Pillow. Alright, it's been real. See you guys next time. Bye! Hi, my name is Falcon, and welcome to my show. It's a singing show. I like to sing about my show.